hello uh, this is a quick video to show you uh, how to balance uh, lithium-ion cells uh, it can be a Voltacon battery or pylon tech or other batteries uh, in this scenario we have our Voltacon batteries 2.4 kilowatt hours we tested this battery bank for a couple of days without the BMS and uh, all the cells all the batteries uh, were completely unbalanced the state of charge um, was uh, out of, uh, let's say, uh, the voltage that we set. We had the first battery and the second having almost depleted. The other batteries have uh, another state of charge. So uh, it's completely wrong to run a system without a BMS uh, cable. So here is our BMS cable now connected to the off-grid inverter. So what we did to balance the cells we switched off the AC output of the inverter, we entered the menu 5 and from menu 5 we selected USC, user mode, because user mode will allow us to uh, change uh, the bulk charge and the float charge. So we did the USC mode and then we visited the menus to NT6. We set 52.5, menu 27, 52.5, for lithium-ion batteries float and bulk charge remains the same, and in menu 29 we set this to 48 volts, the cutoff voltage, uh, and that way we can equalize the batteries. Once the equalization process is completed and the batteries are fully charged, we switch back to our BMS system, menu 5, PYL or LIB. Uh, also in menu 12, we can set the cutoff voltage or when to return back to the uh, utility charge. If you don't have uh, enough uh, solar power, I recommend you to activate the menu 12 to around 47 uh, volts. This is the voltage when the inverter will start charging from uh, the grid if solar is not adequate. So now the batteries are communicating with the inverter, the icon is flashing, the cells are perfectly balanced, you can see that, yeah. we also use the Victron shunt resistor, so we can uh, measure more accurately the voltage and the current through uh, the batteries, you can connect this to a screen, you can use your mobile phone, uh, the VRM software for Victron. Uh, there is also an interface to Solar Assistant. You can connect this back to the Solar Assistant and monitor um, the power flow with uh, great accuracy. Thank you very much for watching uh, this video.